Man Hot Star and Man of Star International winner in Thailand, RJ De Vera. Hindi naging madali pero sobrang malaking pasasalamat ko kung di dahil kay Lord, hindi naging posible ang lahat. Napakaraming lessons and realizations. Tutunan kong makontento ko anong meron. Tutunan kong makisama. Maging mabuti despite of the failures and criticisms. And higit sa lahat, it made me realize na hindi natatapos ang kwento ng ating buhay sa isang malaking tagumbay. Kaya bilang RJ De Vera, patuloy ko pong gagampanan ng pagiging mabuting halimbawa o inspirasyon sa mga taong naniniwala at patuloy naniniwala sa akin. Kaya gusto kong lupos na magpasalamat sa inyong lahat. Kung di dahil sa inyo, wala ako sa kalagayan mo yun. Thank you to my parents, Romel Absolut, and Cory De Vera for always supporting me. Thank you to my manager, Tito Renz Tuazo, owner of the Arichem, for guiding me all the way in taking care of my career. Thank you, Mishos of Filipinas, PEPS organization, for believing me and trusting me this title. To my national director, Sir Jun Salud, for always being good to us. Salamat din sa pinakamabait namin, Mother J. Of course, thank you kay Sir Carlo Morris Gala sa walang sawang pagbuo ng MOF para matupad ang aming mga pangarap. Thank you sa mga board members, Sir Aski Pascual, Bing Galang, Marian Galang, Albert Morales, James Aliri. To my family, friends, and to my Q&A trainer, Mama Marigona, maraming salamat po. To Tito Ben Alsalud, John Laksa, Sir Brian Chris, Peps family, and of course, RG De Vera Fans Club. Thank you so much as always. And tayo ko lang po sa mga first week ng Mistress. I'd like you to always remember that hindi kayo bandang matalo, hindi pa din kayo bandang manalo. Ulit, this is RG De Vera, your Mistress of Filipinas King, Mana Star International 2023, signing off. RG De Vera, in the home of the champions, Misters of Filipinas Top Model of Universe and third runner-up of Top Model Universe in Turkey, Brent Dalman. As I take my final walk tonight, I am filled with unexplainable emotions, filled with gratitude and hope for the future. My journey in Misters of Filipinas has shaped me to become the man who I am today. From being a first runner-up to be able to compete in the international stage made me realize that in life, there is really no rejection, just a redirection. All of these achievements would be possible if it weren't for the people who supported me in this journey. To my skin doctor's family in Cebu, I beautified, Smile Creations by Doc Fra, Simeon Caetano, Alan De La Fuente, Mikey Apching, Ito Gonzaga, Ryan Chris, Julius Pigaro, Jojo Bragais, Bri Espinada, Quick Thoughts, John Carlo, Bri Santos, Sir Nico Liu, and to the whole Mistress of Filipinas organization and board of directors of PEPS. Sir Carlo, Sir Bing, Miss Marian, Sir James, Mama Rods, Sir Barry, Mother Jay, and Sir Ju. Thank you for giving me this opportunity to fulfill my dreams, especially to Sir Aski who really made this dream of mine possible. Thank you so much for helping me become the man who I am today humble and a wise person to my family and friends thank you for always supporting me this journey may have come to an end but i know that whatever path i take you will all still support me to my gao and alpha family i'm so thankful to have met you guys and thank you for your unwavering support you guys never failed to show me how much you all want to see me succeed in life even after pageantry to my girlfriend, throughout this journey we have faced a lot of obstacles from the preparation of the pageant and everything else in between. But I am happy how we were able to surpass all of them with love and laughter. Thank you for always being by my side. Lastly, to my manager, Sir Albert Katamko, my BNB family, Sir Gilbert, Kuya Jun, Miss Mitch, and Sir Mike. Thank you for welcoming me to the BNB family and for always believing in me. When I had doubts about myself. Once again, this is Brenda Man, your top model of Universe Philippines and top model of Tourism Universe 2024.
Mr. of Filipinas Teenager Universe and the grand winner of Teenager Universe in Indonesia, Lloyd Figueras. Starting with a dream and turning it into reality has been a quite a journey. This platform has been essential for my self-discovery and growth. If a younger version of myself look at what I've achieved now, it will be beyond perplexing. Since I was 16, I faced numerous failures and criticism. But today, I'm proud to say that I moved beyond the uncertainties of life that come with participating in pageantry. This pivotal moment in my life encourages me to seek a stronger version of myself and be an inspiration to others. None of this would have been possible without the unwavering support of my family, who are my reason for persevering, and the incredible people who have guided me in this path to success. To Tita Dindin and the Paraiso ni Anibin family, to Mr. Lawag organization headed by Sir Handelaw and Bidjong Lau, to the city government, tourism, and mayor of Lawag City, and to all the residents, especially those who have contributed to my journey, such as M. De Guo for my appearance, and Miss Amor Albana for my costume. I'm also grateful to the Mr. of Filipinas organization, Sir Carlo Morris Galang for the opportunity, Sir Aski Pascual, Mervyn Galang, Marian Galang, Alper Morales, James Salire, and all the members of the board for giving me this incredible opportunity to represent our country in international events. To my national director, Sir Jun Salu, thank you so much for all the love and support. I also want to extend my heartfelt thanks to Sir Ryan Priest for the suit and Sir Nico Liu for all the bottles. To Inay Marigona Dona Dragusha who worked and helped me to secure my QA. Thank you very much. As well as to all the sponsors and media partners. It's not a goodbye but rather a see you later. As we all move to new paths and opportunities. I am Lloyd Figueras, your first ever Mr. Teenager Universe Grand Winner and Mr. of Filipinas King. Mr. of Filipinas Fitness Supermodel World and first runner-up at Fitness Supermodel World in Vietnam, Godfrey Murillo. Ipapasa ko ang ating title na napanalunan ko last week, ang makurunahan niyo ng Mr. Fitness Supermodel World Philippines 2023 at Mr. Fitness Supermodel World First Runner App sa Golden Elf City, Vietnam. Ay mga natatangi na pambihirang kanalisan sa ating buhay. Maraming salamat sa Diyos sa mga biyayang ito na ipinagkalawin sa akin. Kukunin ko ang pagkakataon na ito. Para pasalamatan ang aking Mr. of Filipinas family, especially Sir Carlo Morris Gala, para sa oportunidad na ito at sa mga tao sa likod ng MORF. Board members, Sir Aski, Sir B, Miss Marian, Sir Perry, and Sir James. At sa aking National Director, Sir June Salu. Ang mga karanasan ko sa pagsali at pagkapanalo sa Mr. of Filipinas ay ang mga karanasan na hindi ko inaasahan na mayayari sa aking buhay. Ang lahat ng ito ay naging posible dahil sa aking manager, Popoy Karatibo, na sumuporta at nag-guide sa akin mula sa opisa. Sa pinakamasipag na handler, Armin Derotas para sa lahat ng tulong, habang buhay ako magpapasalamat sa lahat ng tulong. Sa aking mga sponsors, Mr. Jojo Bragais for my footwear, Mr. Ryan Chris for my outfits, Mr. Simeon Cayetano at Tata Blas Inuela for my national costumes, Photographer, Mr. Nicole Yu. Miss Michelle Joy Paday had a performance last year for my train. To my Mr. Sophie Ines for the Perfect Day Travel Games. Good luck sa inyong lahat. Sa aking pamilya, maraming salamat sa lahat ng suporta at sa lahat ng taong sumuporta mula noon hanggang ngayon. Last month, nakapagtapos ako sa bulay ngayon. At ngayon, tapos na din ang aking rain. Excited ako sa bagong kabalata ng buhay ko. I'm looking forward to what lies ahead. Ang chapter na sinasara ko ngayon, ang isa sa pinaka-memorable na chapter ng buhay ko. Hindi ko ito makakalimutan. At sana, hindi rin nyo ako makalimutan. Ito po si Catherine Tulay Murillo, research ng Pilipinas King, na nagpapasalamat sa inyong lahat.
And finally, 